Hey friends, this is Charting Man Dan of thechartguys.com. If you look down in the description of this video, you'll see a link to our new website, and we are offering a 10-day free trial. Today was day number two, trying out our live webcam during the day. We are looking at intraday charts on the 5, 15-minute, and 60-minute time frames, giving a glimpse of how we would day trade or flip options looking at different stocks. We're also hanging out in the chat room answering any technical analysis questions and looking to guide you on your path to becoming a more profitable trader or investor using charts. Looking at Apple on the daily and weekly time frame, this is the daily chart where each candlestick represents one trading day. We have been highlighting last week the importance of 122 support. With the break of that support, we had an absolute breakdown of the stock. It busted right through its 200-day moving average support, which didn't put up any support. And today, look at all this huge bearish volume. Another big red candlestick closing below the lower Bollinger Band. And the MACD is very steep downward. So there's a lot of things that are telling us a bounce is coming. First of all, in the past two years, the only two times the RSI has gotten below 30 were these two right here. Last time it did, we had a huge bounce and recovery. So we're seeing if a potential bounce on this pullback. It will bounce, it's just a question of when. Our first level of resistance on a bounce is this 200 day moving average resistance at 120.42. This MACD line down is unsustainable and we have the full stows in oversold territory as well. So we are looking for a bounce. We saw a little bit of a bullish pattern unfolding on the five minute chart during our live webcam today. Um, it pulled back and was unable to break the 100 period moving average resistance on the five minute chart, which was a key level we're going to watch going into tomorrow. You should come check out the chat room and see the live webcam so we can go over this together. But looking at the weekly chart, three days left to go in this week. We already have the same amount of volume as last week. Falling through this 50-day moving average support, the bulls really want to see this turn into support again by getting a close above it. That level of resistance now is 117.19. The bulls really need to see a close above that. Otherwise, it is looking like we are going to come down and test the lows from back in the start, end of 2014, start of 2015, and that's all the way down in the lower 100s. 103 was the low of this candlestick. So there could be a $10 drop over the next couple weeks if we do not see the support level hold. RSI still has a little ways to go before hit, it hits oversold. So we'll keep checking back in with Apple. If you subscribe to my YouTube channel, I put these videos out daily. And the website, again, is thechartguys.com. You have nothing to lose by giving the trial a shot. And I look forward to meeting you in the chat room. Have a great night, and thank you for watching.